So then, Lindsay in rehab, Paris in jail, Hollywood seems to love a good scandal. Uh, we're always hearing about the big name bad girls. Now, scandalous pictures of Vanessa Hudgens, the star of that kids' movie High School Musical, which was overwhelmingly popular in the Disney Channel, just came out about two weeks ago. We're told that will probably mean millions for her career. Can a good girl get a break in the industry? Celebrity defense attorney Jeffrey Steinberg now and parenting and wellness expert Dr. Deborah King is with me as well. And Jeffrey, I want to start with you. How does a naked photo equate to millions of dollars for someone in America today? Oh, Bill, you know, they, they, she could sell the rights to it. She could sell the rights on the air. She could sell it. It adds up to her publicity, her value. She, get, she has received, Vanessa has received, because of the, this airing of these uh, photos that she took on a camera, on a cell phone, she's probably the second highest hits on the web this week. Uh, just just above Lycos. You know, it was amazing. Let, let me the, get the, back to that publicity way. point in a moment here, Jeffrey. Dr. King, how do you stop this? Or do you? Or is this just feed into the publicity hungry generation that America is now witnessing? Well, the thing to know is that kids are so savvy today, and they're going to know that uh, Vanessa's photos online aren't going to derail her career. In fact, uh, it may just jumpstart her career. The difficult thing is for parents. Uh, parents are trying to give their children an understanding about the sanctity of the body. And here the, the kids' uh, idols, they're everywhere uh, in, in various stages of undress. What I urge parents to do is to pick images um, rather than focus on negative images, to pick positive images for their children to focus on. Um, you know, someone like Beyonce Knowles, for example. The, the difficult thing is, this message to young girls is all about overemphasis on body image, and that can only lead to uh, eating disorders, for example. Uh, another key thing to remember is that what nudity, uh, the, the subliminal message of nudity is that what you see is what you get. And this is a really confusing message to boys and men. It's no coincidence that in the U.S. today, more than one out of every three girls will be sexually abused before the age of 20. Well, Doctor, I find that very interesting. Jeffrey, I want to go back to you on this. Is, have you found a case yet? where you would do this strictly as a publicity stunt to get more attention. That would eventually lead to the money that you just mentioned in your previous answer. Yeah, well, you know, Paris Hilton, look at it. She was nothing until the, uh, she was, you know, she was just doing regular celebrity stuff, doing little appearances, doing nightclub gigs. And then all of a sudden she did that sex video and she skyrocketed. You know, she's like $300,000 for a nightclub gig. She got her own network series. She did, she did uh, absolutely phenomenal. Look. Uh, for kids these at uh, this age, 18 years young, uh, they got to watch what they're doing on the webs. All these pictures are going to be translated on a website at some point in time. So they got to protect their rights. But the the true fact of this is they make big dollars and they jumpstart careers. Well, they actually make yeah. this stuff up. And you know Hollywood loves it. They love to see the sex. They love to see the scandals. Mm -hmm. They love bright little starlets coming out. And this is the new entree way to make it into the business. This is the new way they Jeffrey, make it into Hollywood. Thank you for your time. You got it. Okay. Sorry to cut you off. You're limited, limited on time. Your Dr. King, thank you for your input too. A valuable thank message you. you have today. Thank you, Doctor.